Well, I think this is about the third party I've been to tonight, actually, but uh, it's a duty run, so I'm just uh, doing the duty run, and I'm disgustingly sober, and I'm hoping at some stage I shall be able to get fairly blotto, but not right now. My favorite drink? Oh, I don't know. It's probably something silly and Brazilian and exotic, like Caprinha or something like that. That's a thought for a dwarf, is it not, eh? <laughs> How does it feel to sweep well, the Oscar? Let's see, a mere 11. Oh, dear me. Well, it's not bad, is it? Not bad at all, really. <laughs> a rather good night for, uh, for the actors, for the entire crew, the whole of New Zealand, and our marvelous fans that we, uh, that, that we are all so appreciative of, and, 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 and really we, we thank them all. I did say that uh, we would... Uh, make three of the biggest pictures of all times and bigger than star wars and and that in uh 20 years time when you look back on the favorite films that you ever saw in your life lord of the rings would be there and i think that uh i think 11 oscars is some gesture and that doesn't of course include the uh, the ones we won last year and the year before that i find it amazing though that we didn't even get a nomination for best cinematographer though the directors guild i believe gave best Cin cinematography to to andrew leslie um, and it is amazing how you can actually make a, the best film of the year without any nominated actors. But then I, <laughs> but then I guess you know the uh, we had to leave something for the other guys. Well, it's the end of the journey for you. Any parting thoughts? All the fans are here to celebrate with you. Well, that's why we're here, and, and that's why later on Peter and, and the rest of the of, of the cast that's in town will be will be probably around just to say hi and hello and and give you our thanks because. You are the people who actually, uh, I, I've been in a number of pictures and one or two of them been quite big. I don't think we've ever had, ever in the history of film, a more mature and sophisticated audience than the audience we had for Lord of the Rings. I think in terms of tonight it'll end in some sort of drunken stupor somewhere. You know, this is a huge, a huge reason why it all worked out for us is because of you guys, you know. You guys were con consistently gunning for us, you went to see the movie so many times, you turned it into the big hit that it is, you know. We, oh, hey, we, um, we totally, we totally appreciate how, how much love and, and care and attention you guys have, have put into the movie and, um, you know, we just hope that you guys are going to keep watching it forever and, you know, show your kids it and remind them what went on and hope that I fix your camera. I mean, we all hold this movie in really high regard, you know, and it's been a highlight for all our careers. That's what we wanted more than anything else, to see this, you know, this kind of gentleman, this, this sweet family guy, you know, just to get up and, and kind of be acknowledged by his peers, you know. So that was, for me, the icing on the cake. And we're just all really thrilled for Pete. He, he put 10 years of his life into it, and, and he's, it's richly deserved, you know. I was just noticing all the famous people, you know. <laughs> oh, Dustin Hoffman. <laughs> that kind of thing. It's great. I mean... You know, it's weird to be in this world. I mean, you kind of feel a little bit strange all the time, you know. But um, on a night like this, we're just soaking it all in. We shot it one day, and then we're told that night that there was a camera problem. We had to reshoot the entire thing the next day. So, uh, that was a tough scene to get through. Because not only did we have to get there once, but we had to get there twice. Um, it was harder in some ways for them because it was so emotional for them and Frodo has sort of made peace with the whole thing. Um, but hard anyway just to see your friends in that state. It was a it was a heavy couple of days, you know. But it's very hard for me to watch the scene now because I sort of it's like watching yourself say goodbye to your best friends, you know. So it, it's hard to get through. I love I love that scene though. I I love it. It's beautiful. Yeah. Thank you. Well, I mean, the fact that there, there weren't any nominations for the actors, I, I don't think bothered any of us. I, I think we've always seen it as the ensemble that I think other people have seen it as as well. It is such an ensemble film. I mean, there are 36 acting parts or speaking roles or something to that effect. Um, that's, everybody is so reliant on, on everybody else. And it's really the, the, the story that sort of drives everyone along. 
Um, you know, and I think that's the way that the movies were kind of marketed, and I think mm. that that's the way that you kind of watch them. You let the movie sort of wash over you, and the characters' journeys kind of wash over you. Um, and in some ways, I think, you know, I think the performances are so good that the actors kind of lose themselves in the characters, and maybe people just take that for granted. But that's fine. You know, we don't... I think getting getting the, the SAG Award for Best Ensemble was so, so special, um, because it really means something to us because that's what it felt like. It was a fellowship and an ensemble making the films. So to be acknowledged for that group effort was really special to us. Yeah, it's a wild thing to be a part of. And the fact that it has become such a massive part of the culture now with these films and it's sort of integrated itself into pop culture so quickly, it's wild. It's amazing. I don't think I'll ever be a part of anything again quite like it. So. Oh, hey, what's up? How are you? Good. Hopefully, you. Thanks. Like and also, you made it to the party. I did. I said I'd be here. And you're here. I'm here. Anything to say to all those crazy <laughs> screen fans? I'm um, thrilled that you just swept the Oscars. Singing, dancing, drinking. I'm kind of in shock at the moment. It's sort of hard to come up with any words for anything. Um, but uh, yeah, I don't know. It's a, it's an honor to be at this party. I've missed it every year. Uh, so to finally, you know, it, it's the last one, so it's, it's bloody good that I'm here. Um, I don't know. Thanks to the fans for continuing to support us. I mean, in some ways, it's largely because of them that we got those awards tonight, so thank you. I'm sure the whole country is partying, I imagine. I'm sure it's going to be crazy, probably. Peter, crazy. Hey. Just here to welcome you to the party. Thank you very much. Thank you very, very much. It's great to be here, and thank you for all the support over the years. And you're, this this was a hell of a lucky pin, I'll tell you. It was really great. Great. I'm nowhere near as nervous as I was two or three hours ago. How nervous were you? Feeling pretty good, pardon? How nervous were you? Oh, I was incredibly nervous. I mean, you just, you just guts all churned up. You, know, you got butterflies the size of jumbo jets. <laughs> oh, yeah, well, you got to kind of look cool, but, you know. It's, he probably was. I'm sure if, if, if it's possible for Cameron to have been there tonight, he would have damn well made sure he was. I'm sure of that. Time, and he would have had a good time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 How did you feel when he all 11? Well, all 11 was amazing. It just, I mean, to me, it just showed that, that there was such incredible goodwill towards um, the, the, the films that we'd made from the industry. And that was really touching. I mean, it was just people just wanted to vote for these movies and wanted to to show their appreciation with their vote, and that's an incredibly touching thing. Were you surprised after the last two Academy Awards? Um, oh, I, mean, I was surprised. I, I, I would have never thought that we would have won all, all 11. I mean, I was, I was hoping to win some, but if I was a betting man, I would have never bet for all 11. I would have lost money. <laughs> so, so, I, 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 with all these fans here who've been so supportive of the One Ring. Smile I mean, we, we love our fans, and they've been just one of the reasons why we've tried so hard to make these films good. So, <laughs> <I'm here laughs> <to go. laughs> Peter Jackson has just uh, walked on by, and with that, we'll say good night. Time to party.